This is a pavilion that I had designed and created. This is named after its concept and how the national plant of the Philippines. The pavilion has a dimension of 54.4 meters by 27.2 meters in real life. The setting is at a portion of a park. Each inspiration of the design from the landscape and the building itself is based from the nation's Maharlika patterns. The pavilion's roof is made of broomsticks or what we call Malistin Team. But in real life scale, it's supposed to be made of bamboo, which is a lightweight and sustainable material. The orientation was fixed in a manner to avail maximum natural ventilation and lighting while preventing the direct sun rays and entering the interior. Inside the pavilion, there are two rooms which walls are made of natural stones. One is for public restrooms and another is for utilities and storage. Natural stones could be found from the earliest architecture in the Philippines. Serving a similar function to the original, these stones are sturdy and can increase the support to the roof. On the ground and to the sidings of the lake, they were also made of natural stones to prevent the soil or the field from colliding. The floor of the pavilion is made of dry cliff walls which are comfortable for the field. There are a total of six columns. From the back, they are made of woods. These columns are hollow which could be installed with light and also achieve a lantern look for aesthetics. Lights directing to the stairs could be helpful, especially at night so that people can see their specs. The lights I have used in the scale model are only battery-operated string lights. Warm color for the building and the lake, while white color for the screen types. The space on the front could be used as a stage for performance when there is an event held in the park. It is at the center in which the crowd can easily see. There are three bridges connecting to the building, to the lake. They are made of timber, plants in real life, but in this scale model, I use popsicle sticks and paint them with my water bottle. The purpose of this is to help an amount of crowd that is entering and exiting from the building. This is to prevent the stampede if the emergency arrives. The bridge is supposed to have a railings, but due to the small scale of my work, I didn't have a chance to install it. The lace are placed on the south to minimize the heat from entering the building during wood. In this scale model, I use epoxy resin as a water because it is glossy and can manipulate the same texture of a water. The building is supposed to have more trees than what have been displayed. The trees have been fewer due to the reason that they will cover the entire building and cannot be seen in the camera. These trees help to contribute fresh air and gives shades. It will be good to have more trees in the park so that people could walk around without having a concern about the sunlight in noon and afternoon time. I have created these trees and shrubs by using old ropes, painting them in black and powdered fine artificial ferns to serve as leaves. In this grass, I use wolves. The whole platform itself has a dimension of 12 by 12 inches. I use Sintra board and illustration board to create this. It takes at least 20 days for me to build the scale model and that's all and thank you.